one stop for you hero group two. Come nice play fast for me, yeah. Woo! Uh, I really can't. <laughs> uh, says literally can't just runs away. <laughs> Did you guys not hear me play back super loud? No. Yes. Yeah, it was probably me. <laughs> All right. I tried well, running away. John Taylor. We got to witness ghost events, escape a ghost hunt, and prevent a ghost hunt with a crucifix. All right, I'll get my handy dandy crucifix. Got my handy dandy thermometer. Oh, she went all southern on us. Thermometer. <laughs> all righty then. We'll do this. We'll do this, that, with a side of this, and a little bit of that. Pick that up, and oh yeah. Oh yeah. I can't open the door. Are you doing that? <laughs> Where are you? Yes. How old are you? Are you friendly? Attack. What? Okay. what? So we have spirit box. Yep. Go ahead and throw that crucifix down right there. All right, let's see. Evidence, spirit box. Uh, we'll bring in a spirit book and a UV light. Okay, I found the breaker. Breaker's on. All right, I brought. I'm bringing in a spirit book and a spirit uh, black light. Sorry. I have a dots projector. And oh, oh, that's somebody. I thought something was walking, but it's somebody in the bathroom. I thought it was too. Why is it so bright right there? Because they've got all the lights on. Oh, uh, all right. Let me bring the book and the oh, and the black light in there. Hello? Is anybody here? Is there any... Any, uh, black light evidence anywhere? Hello? Where are you? I'm not getting any, like, thermometer evidence, so... I'm gonna go grab some other stuff. Okay. His name's John Taylor. Yeah. Where are you? Are you here? Ew. Did you hear that? Hey, I think he's there. <laughs> he was like, I'm here. What do we need? Uh. Well, I brought in um, spirit book and a black light. We can probably oh, bring in okay. another dots and another video camera so we can do a different angle. Blowing out all my candles. John Taylor, I'm gonna need you to kindly not. Have you used one of the tactical burritos? Uh, photos. Hey, we got a uh, three gold star footstep photo from my salt right here. John Taylor, do you mind writing in this book for me? Preferably. <laughs> I don't think he wants to use the... Oh, okay. Okay. What's the EMF at? Two. Is it because you don't want to use the pen? Do you want a pencil instead? <laughs> Babe, did you put down the new dots and the new video camera? Video camera's in the kitchen. I don't know about the dots projector. 
So she. All right. Well, you didn't bring it in. I have it. She just said die. And I'm gonna go bring in the other DOS, DOS projector. projector. All right, it's right here. What does it look like? That box right there. I want it. Okay, you can go I'm place it. it in the kitchen. Okay. He said die. By the way. I don't think we're getting there we go I haven't seen anything dots related just yet is he still responding in the bathroom Okay, so he's still he's still oh, hanging. He wrote in the book. He's oh, writing in nice. The book. Get a picture of that. So we have a spirit, a poltergeist, or a bear. All right. Well, a spirit is going to be EMF five. Poltergeist is going to be fingerprints, and a mare is going to be ghost orbs. I'm not seeing, I've been using the black light and I have not seen any fingerprints and I've been watching the well, cameras. Gonna hide it. Oh yeah, yeah, I forgot, nightmare. All right. So we now have to try and figure out what it is by kind of like trial and error. If we turn off all of the lights around, it should increase the chances of it attacking if it's a mare, because turning on the lights around a mare will lower its chances to attack. Alright, so a spirit says that spirits are very common ghosts. They're very powerful but passive, only attacking when they need to. They defend their place of death at the utmost degree, killing anyone that is caught overstaying their welcome. Um, well, I'm chilling in the bathroom. <laughs> And then Poltergeist, um, it's known for manipulating a lot of objects, which I haven't heard anything being moved. It really hasn't thrown much. And then a mare, um, it's strength that it will have an increased chance to attack in the dark, and its weakness, weakness is turning on lights will lower its chance. However, keep in mind that we did have that phone going off in the house. Yeah, but that's not, like, throwing things around. Like, poltergeists like to throw things around. Well, that's manipulating an object. Yeah, you're right. Um, as of now, we've had the breaker on this whole time, and it hasn't attacked yet. So Tyler's theory of turning the lights off, and if it attacks, then I think that we would know it would be a mare, right? Well, let me I turn the breaker so. off real quick. And I'm leaning towards a mare anyways, just based off of know the light situation but well it could also easily be emf5 though we've been getting emf levels but we haven't got, ever gotten a full emf5 it's a mare it's a mare it's a mare i don't think it's hunting anymore it's a mare for sure was that a fake hunt it, it, it started hunting once you killed the breaker, Tyler. I think so. The door's still okay, open. Okay, well, breaker's back on. Let's start turning on lights then. Yeah, it started hunting once we killed the light, so I think it's a mare. I've got both crucifixes in there. There's one in the hallway and one by the bathroom, so what do they look like? Not touched. I think it's a mare. Mm-hmm. What last piece of evidence was for the mare? Fingerprints? Uh, no, no, a mare is going to be... Uh, ghost orbs, I think. Yeah, ghost orbs. So, what are our... What side objectives do we need to complete? We have to... Prevent the ghost from hunting with a crucifix and escape, and have a member of your team escape the ghost during a hunt. We need to kill the lights.
to make this work then. I'm gonna kill the breaker then. We need it to hunt, unfortunately. Yeah, go ahead and kill the breaker and if it starts hunting again, then that's how we know. Breaker is off. All right, trying to antagonize it now. All right, John Taylor, no, hello, hello, hello. Should we call it a wimp? Um, I'm really scared, I don't want to die. John Taylor, you're a wimp. He didn't care. <laughs> Rolled right oh. off his back. Tough cookie. He's hunting. Oh, just kidding. Oh. Was that a fake hunt? We got a three gold star picture of the ghost, Brianna. Hello? Hey. <laughs> All for nothing. I mean, they know what they have. They have a oh, mare and we got the right pictures. Right? They just need to leave now. What the heck? Where did Brianna die too? Brianna, are you dead? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they can just get a picture of our body and then get the heck out now of Dodge. Unless they're downstairs in the basement. I forgot there's a basement. Uh, yes. That's oh. probably where they're at. Uh oh. Went downstairs. Where is he? Nope, it went back to the garage. It went upstairs. It stopped hunting. Picture and there's a bone right here. Oh, oh wow, God. there was a Brianna. There's oh, a bone there's a right you. between us down here. It's a little bone hand. I'm gonna go get pictures Hi. of their bodies real quick. I need to go grab another camera. Oh, okay. he's brave. That's a high yeah, there's a bone down there. Yeah, I don't know if they got a picture of that bone down there. I don't think they got the camera yet. So we got wow. A bunch of bad pictures. We got a three gold star footstep, dirty water, and an interaction, and a ghost, and a dead body. The rest of them are bogus. Oh, they're leaving. They're not even going to go take the pictures? <laughs> oh my gosh. They just... You look like a creeper down there. Hi. Just peeking around, <laughs> peeking around the wall. <laughs> Welcome back. 22 whole dollars? <gasps> Woohoo! 180. On I Nightmare? I needed that money. I was broke. They need to definitely increase the money on Nightmare. 
I that's, agree. That's that is the, ridiculous. That's the same amount of money we were getting on professional. Like, there's no reason to play Nightmare if we're going to get the same amount of money. They should double that. You're risking so much more on Nightmare. <laughs> at least double. Yeah. All right, I'd guys. Say at well, least three percent more. You guys managed to figure <laughs> out it was a mayor, and we uh, at least got two of you guys out alive. Hope you guys enjoyed some more Phasmophobia. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.